Um, can you just please explain for me why you came to create a science-based company? Um, I've always been interested in science. I've been involved in <coughs> a... Sorry. <coughs> sorry. I've, I've been in the corporate for the last 20-odd years. Um, or I really enjoyed doing the work there, R&D and stuff. And I thought, why not apply all the things that I'd learned in the last 20-odd years and help create a startup? That was basically the issue. And, um, you know, lots of problems to solve and interesting stuff. So can you just give me an example of a problem that you're solving at the moment with your business? Well, it's, it's a fairly common problem. It's all about um, mobile reception. Uh, we're helping roll out uh, better um, 4G networks, creating the infrastructure to allow them all to link together so you get better reception in the home or uh, maybe down a motorway or something like that. So it's, it's basically creating a better network. Fantastic. And can you tell me why you think being an entrepreneur is a high-impact career choice? Um, well, it's a high impact for myself and my family because there's quite a lot of sacrifice. But, um, you know, with a very small number of people, you can create massive amounts of, of IP, uh, basically for the, the country, and, you know, it's, it's great fun. I mean, it's, I'm sorry if that sounds slightly incoherent, but it is, it's good fun. So That's there you great. go. It's great. And what did you study at school? out of interest in order for you to be able to do what you're doing today? Um, when I was going through A-levels, I did maths and physics and chemistry, um, like a lot of guys who then went into engineering. Um, and yeah, I did physics and engineering at university. And w would you recommend those subject choices for children today? Uh, yes, because it, it allows you to do many, many types of, of jobs. I mean, you can either stay in the, the science uh, uh, areas or you can, I mean, any number of different roles or jobs that you can get uh, in a science-based uh, background. So yes, I would. And as I say, it's very interesting work. Thank you, Henry. Fantastic.